starting goaltenders for this hockey game tonight for the Maine Black Bears. Uh, they are going to be going with Matthew Thiessen. Thiessen, 11 games, 1-7-3 and three on the season, 9.04 save percentage, and a 3.57 goals against. He's 0-1 against Merrimack. There you see Hugo Olas. He'll be in goal down to our right. Hugo in his freshman year out of Lincoln, Sweden, 9-5, and five, a 9.27 save percentage, and the goals against have been even two. Merrimack in the home white. Navy in gold trim. They'll skate from right to left here in the first period. Maine in the familiar traveling dark blue with white and silver trim. They'll go from left to right. The puck is on the ice. Playoff hockey is underway. Jeffries near circle. Jeffries holding. Cross ice pass. Quick shot on goal. Save Thiessen. And Merrimack keeps it in. Score! Steven Jandrick will get an unassisted goal to give Merrimack a 1-0 lead. 12-23 on the power play. Warriors strike first for the first time in seven games. All right, Merrimack with the puck at center ice. They'll attack over the Black Bear line in front. Force mark, he's in the load, score! <laughs> Get up, Force mark at the 34-second mark. And the Warriors have increased the lead to 2-0. Welsher inside the blue line. Welsher fires, deflected on goal, save, rebound, score! Matt Capone with the goal after Welsher's initial shot was blocked. Capone sweeps it in at 4.07, 3-0 Merrimack. Jeffries turns the puck over in the defensive zone. Comes over to Breen, he's got room down low, he scores! Off the turnover, Lyndon Breen will put Maine on the board. And at 13.49, a costly turnover for Merrimack, and Maine is on the board for the line, Jandrick. At the near circle, Jandrick moving in. Jandrick behind a goal, lays it out in front, no one there to collect. Brown has it, his shot, trickles in, score! Max Newton will get the goal! Mike Brown will pick up his first collegiate point, and Merrimack takes a 4-1 to one lead. Capone swings it over to Forsmark in front. Walsh with a drive, he scores! Liam Walsh! And that could be the dagger that puts this one away. The Warriors lead it now 5 to 1 with 8.54 to go. And Merrimack will fight for the loose puck in the offensive zone with the goaltender pulled for Ben Barr. Cool behind the goal, battling Forsmark. Forsmark centers it out in front, the puck is there. Goal, Max Newton! Into the empty net at 17-02. And the Warriors make it 6-1. Black scored Bay. the first one. Centering pass here, blocked. Quick shot. And it's a score in the slot area. Maine will cut it back to 6-2. To that should be, uh, let's see. It looked like Spicer who may have banged that home. Or maybe it was Fawcett. Yeah, Fawcett. And that'll make it 6-2. to two. So the Black Bears get... One right back at 17.37. As the clock ticks down, and the Merrimack Warriors will advance in the Hockey East playoffs as they defeat the main Black Bears by a score of 6-2. to two. And the Warriors will move on, and they will take on the UMass Lowell Riverhawks on Saturday at Songa Center. It'll be the 19th win of the season for Merrimack as the Warriors defeat Maine 6-2.